Hey guys, I'm AJ. Uh, Anthony Johnson is my full name. I'm a linebacker. Jake Lutecki, I'm defensive coordinator. Bailey Mullenberg, defensive end. <laughs> Our first question, can you three talk about the culture on the defensive side of the football this year and how it has changed from last year? Yeah, so, so this year we're really focused on, on playing hard, playing fast, and playing physical. So priority number one for us is to all get to know each other, love our teammates. Um, we're very focused on communication and takeaways this fall. Um, I think a big thing that we did, did like different from last year was our weight room culture is huge now. We got guys turning up in the weight room after everybody, doesn't matter who you are, offense, defense, freshman. You come in, we get you lit, we get you ready to party. So what I'm putting out here. Yeah, I'd like to add on AJ. I think the weight room has, especially this off season, has been great. A lot of people have gotten a lot bigger. And I think a lot of guys are starting to understand why we do things around here. So you guys are in the middle of fall camp. Could you uh, give us a little details of how fall camp has been, some ups and downs, and uh, maybe share a few memories? Uh, fall camp, uh, it's been really fun. A lot, of, a lot of guys get together and we'll hang out in between the breaks that we do have. Uh, I think everybody's been pretty locked in compared to other years, so it's been really good. Um, I'm also having a lot of fun. I love uh, warming up in this hot gym that we're in. Uh, it makes me feel really excited about my workouts. Uh, <laughs> I love I love the heat, too. That's also super exciting. But uh, I love the way we're playing on the field right now. Um, our chemistry as a team has just felt so much better. I, I know we know every guy across the ball in front of you guys. These guys want to compete, so it's going to be an amazing season we've got going for us. Yeah, it's been a good good grind. It's been fun. It's been a lot of work. Guys have been getting after it. Um, it's been impressive to see on the defensive side of the ball, uh, our older returners really embrace these freshmen and get to know them and bring them into our culture. And uh, you can really see that the, the buy-in is 100% this year. So it's been a fun camp. With a lot of returners on the defensive side of the ball, tend to be exact, what are the expectations on your side this year? Um, I think a big thing that we need to start with is just kind of knowing our assignment and aligning playing fast to it. I think that's a huge thing is going to be for us with all of us coming back and knowing our job from last year. I think it's going to help us a lot when we can just get out on the field in the first play and know exactly what we're doing every rep. Uh, I think a huge thing this year is we need to uh, focus on stopping the run. I think that will really improve our play. And yeah. I think uh, ultimately I don't want the guys to necessarily focus on the outcome. Uh, I just want them to focus on getting a little bit better each and every single day. So we're really focused on the, the day in and day out, little things that make you a great football player. What are some strengths of this defense going to be? Um, I think three of our biggest strengths is going to be our new thing that we put in this year. It's called the Comic Creed. So our first one is play hard, play fast, play together. I think if we can stick to that, it's going to be some of our biggest strengths going on our side of the ball. Uh, I think a lot of us players on the defensive side of the ball have really matured, and I think the freshmen that we have in this year are really talented and are ready to roll. Yeah, I think our, our strength in our defense is going to be our effort, incredible effort every single play. Guys flying around like their faces are on fire, getting to the football. Um, we're going to be super fast, aggressive, and attacking all year. With the first game right around the corner coming up August 26th in Montana, what are you most looking forward to about this trip? Um, definitely the road tripping part. Uh, come back at W. It's always the best time when you're coming back on that bus with your boys. So I'm excited to just fly around, have fun, play football again. Yeah, I would have to agree with AJ. I really like bus rides. Uh, it's fun going down all together and then playing football. Yeah, I'm just excited to, to <laughs> cut these guys loose against somebody else other than ourselves. You know, it gets old day in, day out of camp, uh, smacking each other. We're just excited to, to let loose on someone else and get after it. Adding Coach Olson from Hillsborough High School coming over and getting coach with the comments this fall. How has he adapted and uh, how has he been uh, in the defensive line meeting rooms? Uh, he's been really he's been really confident in what he's saying. He's got a lot of years in, in coaching football, so he knows what he's talking about. Uh, he's not shy or anything, and if you rip, he's gonna rip India if you mess up. So he's not not shy about it. <laughs> Uh, he's, he's been a great asset to our defensive staff, ton of experience, ton of knowledge, um, a guy who's just done it for a long time and he really just uh, fit in right out of the gate. So we're, I'm super lucky to have him. We're super fortunate to have Coach Olson. With about 20 new freshman uh, transfers coming into the common defense, how is their game translating and how are they fitting into the culture? Uh, I think the biggest thing this year compared to any other year, uh, definitely getting a lot closer with the upperclassmen than not too shy, they like to talk, and I think they understand that we're on a mission to win games this year.
Um, I think one thing that I've noticed is uh, a big word is just confidence with them. I think a lot of these guys will come out and right away they're a little shy, just getting to know the people and all the upperclassmen. But once they get that little bit of confidence in them, it just sparks and it's just, they start flying all over the place and doing things that they know, like how to play and stuff like that. Yeah, I think we got some some really talented young guys that have meshed well with the older guys. And I think, you know, you're going to see some of those young guys on Saturday. We got some dudes that can play. Um, they fit into the culture great. They really bought in and uh, testament to these older guys, taking care of them, showing them around and showing them how we operate as a common defense.